All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. So we finally have our hands on the brand new skins for this upcoming two weeks. As you guys know, every two weeks, Fortnite releases new skins, pickaxes, gliders, you know, trails, emotes, etc., etc. And every two weeks at the beginning of that update for those two weeks, unfortunately, it was on a Thursday this week because the update of this week got delayed. And to be honest, there's not even that many significant changes in the game but it got delayed so we're doing it today on a thursday so really quickly before we get into the skins i just want to let you know that there has been some minor changes to the game for instance we got the new uh, grappler uh the revolver has been now bolted some of the weapon rarities have changed um i also read that there's no more legendary bolts the dual pistols have been decreased in rarity as well i i, I don't know why this was never a thing i always felt like the dual pistols were so freaking common i would see a dual pistol at least four times per game and it was always an epic or a legendary it's it's kind of like the port of ford they're, they're, you see them so much but they're so rare so finally that has been nerfed of course now they're going uh from an epic legendary to a rare and epic so now you're going to see them in blue and in purple instead of purple and yellow the suppressed pistol is another one of those weapons they're supposed to be so rare and you see the more that you see scars and and heavy shotguns and stuff so they went from an epic and legendary to a rare and epic so pretty much the same thing as the dual wield pistols okay I, th I completely completely agree with that when these weapons first came out they were super overpowered like those pistols i mean they're still really good but they were i mean they were fucking insane now they're a little bit more nerfed down, so they've changed the rarity. Burst Assault Rifles. For those of you that are fans of Burst Assault Rifles, and I'm going to be honest, if you know how to use them properly, Burst Assault Rifles could be better than automatics. They're really, really, really good if you know how to use them and when to use them. So, for those of you that are fans of the Burst, it's been buffed. So, when you hold down the trigger, the first two Burst Rounds are now going to be more accurate. The spread down sight benefits increased from 35% to 40%. That's a 10% increase. Crouch spread benefit reduced from 25 to 20. Jumping falling spread penalty reduced from 25 to 10. Sprinting spread penalty reduced from 50 to 30%. That's a pretty decent change for the burst assault rifle, okay? The only thing that I'm waiting for now is when is the regular automatic rifle gonna get a little nice buff like this? That when I'm holding down my fucking trigger, my bullets are actually hitting my target for those of you that don't know there is blooming in this game which means you are not or you should not hold down your trigger on your assault rifles because it's pretty much just not going to hit the targets that's yeah it sounds really stupid but blooming effect it's a weird thing the fortnite has i don't i at this point i want to say it's on purpose so everything is not just so speed on accurate it's something that it looks like they've never really gone about to fixing or whatnot but i guess this is a step in the right direction there's uh the common smg has been removed that doesn't mean that these weapons have been removed it's just a rarity okay the uh, port of fort went from an epic to a rare we can now carry three big shields in one slot instead of two the uh boogie bombs not come in twos instead of one um you can now carry up to six stink bombs instead of five etc etc and other things that we've pretty much discussed and then of course there's like minor changes to the map here and there but nothing too drastic now i will say the upcoming skins for this week's update they're not all that they're okay i've seen better i this is probably one of my least favorite bundles of skins um there are two skins that i really like and the rest are okay i feel like again fortnite's bringing too many bundles even though there's really not that many bundles in this week but there's still some bundles here like female and male characters i feel like at the end of the day they're, they're just trying to chip us from like real original skins anyways I, I'm, I'm just talking shit all right so the first skin that we're gonna get into here is the wild card this is one skin that we've been seeing for a while now i like it dude this is my favorite one it's pretty much like a like a white suit john wick except you have a mask that's customizable for those of you that are still out of the loop you can customize this map with up to four different patterns which is pretty cool it's a nice little feature um it's gonna be nice running like a regular john wick and then this one or vice versa uh or, or two of the same i don't know it's it's a freaky skin man when you see a slim male character you better run next up we have a, a bundle a set of two skins it's i again we don't have the names of these skins because it's really really early in the morning it's four in the morning the names have not been released neither have the rarity so please bear with me at least you guys will get to see the skins here next up uh we're gonna have the female rocker chick again i don't know her name the only thing that i like about this chick is 
Honestly, her hair is pretty cool. The glasses are okay. The jacket is dope. I like the jacket. She's got like little spikes on top of her shoulders. Um, and then that's pretty much it. Then you have the male counterpart, which is, I don't know what this dude's on, but <laughs> I guess it's fine. It's pretty cool, I guess. I honestly wish I had the names for these skins for you. But we don't. And of course, the rarities. If I do get them by the time the video is uploaded, I'll put them in the description or something. But here you guys have the first bundle of this bi-weekly skin update. Next up, we have probably my second favorite skin out of the bundle right after the wild card. Again, I would assume this guy's probably going to be like an epic or, or a legendary. I want to say he's probably going to come with a back bling. Um, but this looks like it's another move. Not as drastic as like a T-Rex or a Triceratops where they're fully into a costume, but semi as to what that, you know, whole little idea is going for. Because he does have a hoodie. The hoodie does have like these bat wings as ears and these googly fish eyes. It's pretty cool. Honestly, I think it's dope. Um, I, I wouldn't be surprised if we eventually get a female counterpart to this skin. But right now, this is what we have. Then we have what appears to be some type of pirate or at least it looks like in this angle, or it could be some type of maybe Viking or something. I, I don't know. This is a pretty cool skin. Not going to lie. It's okay. It's not that bad. Um, I want to assume he's probably going to come with a pickaxe and glider. Of course, we'll, we'll, we'll find out as we go down through this list here. And then we have another bundle, which is actually something that I, I'm surprised didn't come earlier because this is such a significant piece of item in the game. And that's going to be the meds. Okay, we got medics. We got medics finally in Fortnite. So you have the female medic and then you have the male medic. You already know I'm rolling with that female medic. Truth be told, they look pretty nice. And then the last and final skin is what appears to be some type of green commando hardcore Rambo dude. Um, we've, we've seen some similar skins, you know, to this one. Um, there have been some skins that look pretty similar to it but i just don't find this skin that unique to be honest um but it's okay it's something that i'm probably gonna buy because i'm still gonna <laughs> bring the gameplay but it's too similar to a bunch of like old skins that we've had except different color schemes that's pretty much for the skins to be honest not a lot of skins in comparison to previous um updates but who knows maybe there is uh some other shit coming we're gonna get into the gliders the first glider is gonna be the wild card glider as you guys know you, know, you got all the money bags, the you know, the gold and, and all that funky stuff. Uh, next glider, we have a chopper, a medic chopper, which honestly looks really badass. This is super, super cool. I want to say that this update skins are maybe not the greatest, but the gliders are looking pretty nice. The so next one, you have a back to the future type of car glider, which honestly, it's, it's pretty awesome. The last and final glider is... <laughs> It's a pretty similar glider to the one that we got at the beginning of the season. But if you look at the little art on the top is uh, the angel skin with the uh, pink little teddy bear skin falling in love. Cupid has struck her heart and they're falling in love. OK, that's it for the uh, gliders. Now, the pickaxes, we got the crowbar. We know how to unlock this crowbar. I made a video about that. All you have to do is pretty much complete the uh, high stakes challenges and you get the crowbar. Next up, it appears to be like you have an IV stick pull first aid logo in the middle. Obviously, this belongs to the medics. Um, and honestly, it's it's pretty cool. I like it. I think it's pretty nice. Then we have what appears to be another Viking like pickaxe. It's, it's kind of like a really, really big axe. That one's actually pretty nice. Very rustic looking. I like it. I feel like the skins are OK, but the pickaxes and gliders are actually pretty nice. Now that I'm actually here looking at this. Then we have another one, which is a microphone. I want to say that this is probably um, trying to go hand in hand with the rock female, uh, the rocker female and then the male dude as well. And then the last but not least, the last pickaxe. I don't know what to call it. It's just a pretty familiar pickaxe that we've had in the game before, but a different color scheme. Back blings. We got a medic back bling. And of course, you got the male medic back bling and you got the female medic back bling. Pretty freaking awesome indeed. I like those back blinks. Pretty cool. Then you have the purple guitar. It looks pretty nice. I like it. I'm digging it. Again, everything's nice in this in this update, in my opinion, except the skins. The skins are okay. The next back bling appears to be some type of green backpack. Honestly, I'd be lying to you if I told you what skin this belongs to. Following that one, we have the suitcase with the handcuffs, which obviously we've seen before. It belongs to the wild card skin. And then the last one is the one right here that obviously this back bling belongs to the... Uh, rocker dude and the rocker chick so that is pretty much for this bi-weekly update let me know what you think of the skins back blings pickaxes i i think some of the 
gliders are, are are pretty dope some of the pickaxes are are nice the skins only i only like two the wild card and then the hoodie guy the rest are okay nothing too special in my opinion but um of course you cannot always have great everything because you know people that work at epic are only human dude they already bring enough updates as it is but that's gonna be it for this video for the uh skins and stuff let me know what you guys think of them in the comments below if you enjoyed the video found it somewhat helpful informative leave it a like i'll catch you later <laughs>